Protesters in Hong Kong will combine their demonstrations with celebrations to mark the Mid-Autumn Festival this weekend. Several protests have been planned around the city. And because of this, train operator MTR has cancelled overnight train services that usually run during holidays and festivals. The rare move comes after the rail operator became the target of radical protests in recent weeks. Police have banned a mass rally planned for this Sunday on Hong Kong Island due to public safety concerns. Organizers of the march, the Civil Human Rights Front, said they plan to appeal the decision. Our correspondent, Yong Wai Kid, tells us what to expect this weekend in Hong Kong. Well, we can expect violence. And that's in the words of the police who came out on Thursday saying that that's the main reason that they banned a large-scale peaceful rally that's planned for Sunday. Uh, of course, that's in the appeal stage, so that remains to be seen as to whether it will really be banned on Sunday. Uh, the second event is an, another airport stress test. Um, but based on what we saw uh, in the last stress test on Saturday, um, that didn't materialize, and uh, that's also because there were many police boots on the ground. They were proactively checking uh, people with no boarding passes going towards the airport. Uh, so it's, there's a lot of speculation that that will not materialize on uh, Saturday, but that also, again, remains to be seen. The other interesting uh, event that we're keeping a close watch on is what you said earlier, uh, the Mid-Autumn Festival celebrations come rarely. Now, quick context. In Hong Kong, Mid-Autumn Festival is a big deal to people. Uh, families spend time together, eat dinner together, eat lunch together. Some companies let their staff go back early so that they can have reunion dinner with their families. So the turnout for this uh, event will be a very interesting indicator. Will people stick to tradition and, and, and remain with their families or do they feel it's more important to come out and have their voices heard? Now the other point I want to make is that, you know, this of course, it's uh, a celebration. People are encouraged to come out and uh, carry lanterns. And if there are many people carrying lanterns, whether accidentally or intentionally, there's going to be fire hazard. And these days, when you attend rallies, it's not unfair to have a mindset to, that tells yourself, you know, expect the worst.